Stephen uh, apologizes for not being able to come. Um, he would have very much liked uh, to be with us today, um, but he feels too weak uh, today to um, go around. So here is the statement which he uh, just sent me, which I believe um, resonates with um, what Stanislas evoked about the sort of the original idea for this workshop. I quote, it is not clear whether intelligence has any long-term survival value. Bacteria multiply and flourish without it. However, intelligence is central to what it means to be human. It allows us to learn more about ourselves and our environment, and as a species, it gives us a competitive edge. Everything our civilization has achieved is a product of human intelligence. I regard it as a triumph that we, who are ourselves mere stardust, have come to such a detailed understanding of the universe in which we live. The potential benefits of creating beneficial artificial intelligence are huge. Used as a toolkit, artificial intelligence can augment our existing intelligence to open up advances in every area of science and society. However, it will also bring dangers. Governments around the world are already funding an artificial intelligence arms race. And in the future, artificial intelligence could develop a will of its own, a will that is in conflict with ours. In short, artificial intelligence will be either the best or the worst thing ever to happen to humanity. We do not yet know which. That is why in 2014, I and a few other scientists called for more research to be done in this area. I feel it is important to have this discussion now in order that the research and its applications benefit society as a whole." End quote. 